the Big Joe herd into this pasture, which is pasture two. Got him into the nine acres. There was a lot of grass, and it was getting kind of dark, and um, we just said scratch it. Uh, they got to reunite with Eleanor again, which was exciting. She was happy about that. Uh, so we just left him and locked him in the nine acres. We tested her pond yesterday with our little aquarium test strips. And you're like, those are aquarium. It's the same thing. You can use it for a pond. Uh, so we did it. Water levels look much better. But, well, the pond just looks so much better in general. We got a bunch of rain this last week. Yeah. Like, I don't know, several inches. I don't know what the actual number was, but it obviously helped equalize the pond a little bit. Yeah. Now we're going to try to get the Big Joe herd. We've got cubes this time. We're going to try to get the Big Joe herd all the way up to pasture two. The reason why we're skipping pasture, we're, they have to go through three, which is where we are now, to get to uh, pasture two. I know it seems confusing. Do we want to have that gate open in the corner? Well, you can, but I've blocked the whole way because I cut a bunch of trees down. Oh. So. So we got to take them from that across gotta, the field we into. We got to take them across and make an adjacent cut, but. Ooh, we put our hot wire, pasture three, divided it and made two pastures. These are our hot wire system we've installed. But our energizer, I may have to put more stakes in the ground. I've only got three for this 1800 i Gallagher system. We're not getting full charge down here. So the problem is, is I don't want to put them out here and think that they can beat the hot wire. They probably can. But we want it to shock them. If they, if you don't have it working and they go up to it, they won't respect it from the get-go. And if they don't, then we'll have issues. So that's why we don't want them to be in three yet. Marissa and I need a little bit more time to work on the hot wire system, get it right. So we need to go from the nine acres all the way up to uh, pasture two, skip three. Hopefully cubes can do it, but they've got a little good graze. They've been in here for what? Less than 12, 12 hours. Taker. She's coming up on the dam. Oh, she stopped. I don't know who it Woo! is. Oh, it's a green tag, I think. Come on. Come on. Big Joe. No takers. <laughs> Come on, bullet. There's a couple. There's one moving. Hold on. Hold on, buddy.
just like that, they see it. Wrong with the drone? 
Oh, if you don't log in the account, it gets weird. Cheese bullet. Account's not logged in. It only lets you fly so far. Mm. your mineral gets hard plus it, it got wet and it dries you just you can go in here and break it up this is our redmond bison 90 and it breaks up easy looks like it needs to dry out it's just have some moisture on it Who's Big Joe following? Can you tell who that is, Dusty? Uh, that looks like... Canadian? All right, so here's something exciting to see. You got Big Joe and Peaches roaming together, Marissa noticed Big Joe is kind of falling around, sniffing over and stuff. So, yep, here she is. He's falling around Peaches, one of our foundation herd. She's the one that likes to run with us and does a good job of um, leading, kind of a lead cow. We just pulled up from picking Brooks up and Big Joe is up here looking, smelling at somebody. Look who it is. Over there giving him the stink eye. Licking his lips. What? No. Well, the good thing is, is we got the Big Joe herd moved up to pasture two. We skipped pasture three, bypassed the new hot wire system. Marissa and I, I've got to get that in fine tune, but I think we will. We'll be okay. Hey, girl. Hey, Morgan Wild. And Miss Cora here, our beautiful girls. But there's something exciting I can't wait to bring to you. We're going to let the new bull out. Still haven't officially got a name for him, but we're going to let him out. And we're going to let him go in the Big Joe herd coming up in the next video. So, guys, stay tuned for that. There's no telling what could happen. There could be some interesting dynamics going on with the new fella joining the Big Joe herd. It could get interesting, Morgan Wild. What do you think? Could be. So, that's what's happening next. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys soon. Keep on Boston Ranching.